finally got the 190E Vito. Clean car for them seats. but you can tell it's definitely all mileage 98,000 miles So, I'm not sure if that's even enough to do anything. So, yeah. It even comes with quite a few parts. I got spark plug wires, I got a new muffler, um, new spark plugs. He's got several parts I've went through here and some new hoses. I got the book. So, yes, yeah, it's gonna be a fun project. Okay, Vito. Um, the only thing that was wrong with the car when I bought it was it's missing the fuel line from here to the cold start injector. So I've got the line ordered, but I plugged this so not to have a leak just to see if I could get it to run. And whenever I sprayed carb cleaner into here, had no starting fluid, but I squirted a little bit of carb cleaner. But um, I haven't really dug in into it real deep. I just wanted to see it here it run and it runs really good off the carb cleaner the fuel pumps are working at least um i believe they are i'm getting quite a bit of fuel pressure coming out of these lines when i crack them open with the fuel pump on and uh, i know i'm getting ignition obviously because it runs great with the carb cleaner i just thought i would uh, send these videos to you and see what your opinion was but um we still have to wash the exterior, but me and my daughter, me and her cleaned the inside of it up. But these, so we cleaned it. Looks really good. It's a really clean car. Put something back here to keep the sun out. Squirted a little bit of carb cleaner into here. And it starts right up and runs, but obviously it does not stay running, or I wouldn't be sending you this video. My question is, will this run without this line? My thinking it would, but I cannot get it to run continuously off its own fuel. I'm getting fuel here and here. I've checked. Uh, so the fuel Okay, pump. Vito, um, I've got this 190E. Um, it's running it's going um, what's wrong with it is the relay module the mass relay module so I jumpered out the one and two terminal fuel pumps kick on and it runs so yeah so I'm gonna I'm gonna wash the car it needs washed but now I know what's wrong with it. Unfortunately, I don't have the money for one of those relay modules right now, so I'm just gonna jumper it out for now. It goes in the gear just fine, runs great. I'm gonna do a tune-up, but yeah, it's a clean car. 
Look at this. Liner. The only spot that the mouse got that. Darn it. Darn mouse. But it's a clean car. It's locked. Yeah. That door buzzer. It's not going to go away. I wonder which one that is. Yep. Let's fix that. Those are good problems. I like this car. Well, I took out the jumper, put the relay module back in, and it's still running. I, I don't know. I had a lot of ants that came out of the uh, the relay module, the MAS relay module. A lot of ants were in there. I shook it, got a lot of the ants out, plugged it back up without the jumper. It's running great now. I'm still missing the um, fuel line to the cold start injector, but it's running just fine without it. And it's pretty warm here in Kentucky, so it's not really that big a deal. I've just got it plugged off at the distributor. But got all the windows down. <laughs> 